James, there's actually money in here. All right, so we're here at the location again. Super excited to be getting uh, this abandoned machine. Always dreamed and thought about getting one of these. So we're gonna go over there. We're gonna get it knocked out and uh, we're gonna see, uh, see what's inside. All right, so we're here at the Coke machine. Very nice looking Dixie Narco. Uh, it says completely sold out, every single one of them. So I'm really hoping it's uh, full of a lot of money as I think they are too. They finally gonna get maybe paid for work and you know how we do it. So go ahead and unplug it. He's itching to get this baby home so we can see what's in it. Uh oh, all right, ooh, ooh, ooh. There we go. Having some technical difficulties, guys. Please hold. All right, so as she said, um, technical difficulties. Uh, it's not gonna fit out of the door because of the bubble front. So we actually went and got some drill bits. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and drill it out and uh, we'll be closer to seeing how much is in it. We're gonna go ahead and drill the lock. We gotta be as quiet as we can because this is at a bank. So what you wanna do, you wanna take a small bit and you actually wanna put it right there in between where it locks and right there, so we're gonna go ahead and drill it. All right, just like that, we got it out. All right, so the good news is we got it open. So, I guess we better go ahead and open it up. Okay, we can't do that. I would love to see exactly what's in it right now because I've been thinking about this for like a month since I asked about this machine. But it just wouldn't be right. We gotta make y'all wait till we get home, unload it, and we can check out the storage unit. So, let's go ahead and load it up. So we got it all loaded up. Now we are headed, um, actually we're not gonna go to the storage unit. We're actually gonna run to uh, a car wash that uh, we sold a machine at. Somehow, uh, we actually have to run. So, when we come back, we're gonna see how much money was in it. Two hours later, all right, guys. So, we're back on location. We got it placed. Uh, everything looking good. You know what time it is. Time to open it up and see what we got. Check it on out. James, there's actually money in here. What? I didn't know if there would actually be any money in there or not. That's that's freaking awesome. It looks like it's quite a it looks quite like a it's quite a bit. Dang, it's quite a bit of money, right? Hell yeah! Wow. All right, let's go ahead and we'll count that in a minute. Let's see if it's got changed and everything else in it. Looks like, looks like the quarters are filled to here. Nickels are all the way up and so are the dimes. <laughs> See how much was in it. I can't believe there was actually money in it. I mean, we got this thing for free. It sat there for a year. Nobody touched it. Nobody called on it. So we did our due diligence, talked to the owner, waited a month, and it's ours now. So we're gonna go ahead and count this up and let y'all know exactly what we found in it. All right, so after opening up the machine and figuring out how much money we got out of it, we got $101 in cash. And the coin mech, we had $38. And in the coin acceptor, we had $35.25 which leaves our grand total to $176.25 in this abandoned cook machine. Thanks for checking out this episode of Dixie.
Thanks for attending. Make sure you like and subscribe.